Hey guys, this is Rosie and welcome to my channel, The Stylish Sicilian. I thought that this month we should kickstart the holiday season with a New Year's dress haul because what is more exciting than a sparkly dress during the holiday season, am I right? I know what you're thinking. Girl, I'm not gonna be spending $100 to $200 on a dress just for one night. I've curated a couple of dresses from ASOS. Not sure if you're familiar, but they actually have really good deals. So all these dresses are gonna be under $100, except for one, because I couldn't behave. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and gonna try those on, and I'm gonna share with you the prices and the sizing and how they feel on me. So stick with me, and let's go ahead and try them. Guys, we're gonna start with the first outfit, which I thought was most exciting to look at and it's the sequin mini dress. The dress is in a size six and it's $64 full price. So I'll step back so you can see it better, but it is a short, but it is so fun to look at. I don't care. I mean, when you're going out for New Year's, you're usually not going to a party with little kids, so mini dresses should come out. <laughs> but um, I do have some thoughts. So we'll start with the cons. The cons are the strap on this is super long. So unless you have some weight in the front to kind of, you you know, I don't know, utilize the extra material here, it's not gonna be great. But if you can tighten it, you have that skill set. I think this is stunning and it's a winner and you should keep it. Like I want it. <laughs> but unfortunately, we are not gonna be doing anything this elaborate this year. At least I don't think. But I'm gonna go ahead and give you a nice spin. So this one, um, it's everything else about it is perfect for me. And again, my my height is 5'6, and my my measurements will be in the description box below for you to reference. But yeah, I definitely need like some more height here <laughs> or something else. But that's the only thing I have a problem with. And really, I guess the band around the bottom here is a little tight, but it has enough give for me. Me. and I mean with any dress you're gonna be a little uncomfortable and that's acceptable for me um there is a zipper down here but I was able to just kind of shimmy it on you know but I'll give you a spin I don't know guys this is so much fun it is pissing me off though how <laughs> it keeps kind of going lower here I'll give you a full view of the dress bear with me <laughs> I'm my own cameraman but yeah it's a good length you know, party length. So for the price point, you can't beat it, but you do need to fix the straps. So I'd say fix the straps and it's still a keep. I love it. And we're back with dress number two. So this one is a satin cowl neck, bustier, midi, all these other SEO words, um, dress in a size six and it is full price $60. I did wanna say I got all these on sale. So ASOS does always have some type of coupon use it don't forget so here we go and i have thoughts positive thoughts mostly but i think actually first of all i'm gonna go ahead and start by saying the fit on this dress is fantastic like it feels so comfortable the straps are adjustable which is already a pro but um the top part for me is always a struggle for obvious reasons but I do think that it fits fantastic and I love it. I'm actually debating if I should keep this for a wedding I have coming up, so there's that. Now, outside of that, that's the good. The bad is, you know, there's a, the problem areas are highlighted, which always bothers me, but that's what you get with this type of material. So take it or leave it. Um, there's a bit of ruching here that's happening that is, I guess, natural to the design from what it seems, but it just doesn't seem like it's flattering. Like it has nothing to do with me. It's just the way the dress is. Is, but the way it flows is not super natural, so that's gonna be a, a bother, possibly. Um, I do like how it highlights your legs in a nice way, and it has like this kind of higher leg line and low and lower down here. But I'll show you the back. It is super pretty, and for the price, you really can't beat it. And you know, satin dresses are super in right now. So outside of all that, oh, and the last thing is it is really wrinkly. It wrinkles super easily. I tried to steam it a bit for the video, but I also wanted to leave a little so you could see how it kind of got wrinkly in the bag. So yes, you have to take some good amount of time to steam it. <laughs> but um, outside of all that, I mean, remember price is a factor here. So if you want this price point, you're gonna have to make some, you know, concessions. So in 
for me, I actually love this dress. I don't even want to take it off. So I'm going to say it's a definite keep. All the links are going to be below also for any of the dresses here today. If you wish to purchase them, these links are commissionable. So I do receive a small little percentage of the sale if you do choose to buy through my links. Um, and it does help my little influencer life continue. So, and also if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe box because it helps me gain more subscribers, obviously, and it helps me become monetized so I could do more and better exciting videos for you. So yes, next dress. And this one's tricky. So this one is $55 at full price and it's a size four. Now, it is beautiful. I'll give it that. And it's usually not my style. This is like something I would never buy, but not because it's not cute. It's just not something I care. I would personally put on because I already see the high neckline and all the, you know, tricky bra situation. And it turns me right off, which is why I never would buy it. But I'm trying things on so that I can, you know, expand my horizons and also to show you guys. So now I'm, I feel restricted and I'll explain why. This is nice, it's fitted, it's a little choky. And in fact, I couldn't get the buttons done because I'm by myself here and I can't reach them. But every time I do this, this part is just not, it is not good. It is not fitted to my body well. Like I had a regular bra strapless and it was totally visible. So I put on like little cups just to kind of like not look weird because <laughs> I do think you need something here to round out but um, it's not fitted if it was more fitted I think it would be okay but it kind of moves too much and I feel like I have to keep my hands like right here and not go anywhere else like I can't be going out like this like I would have to hold myself the whole time so I'm gonna go ahead and already tell you this is a leave but I'll give you a quick little look at this dress one more time and I'll give you the back but yeah definitely a leave and we're back with an elegant, classy number. Now this is ASOS Lux, and it's on the higher price point of this haul. And this is $84 full price. And I got it in a size six. Um, I have some thoughts. So I actually did this haul because I saw this dress and I really wanted to try it on. And that's what inspired this whole thing. So I'm a little disappointed, but, but not in the way that you think. Let's walk through it, shall we? So here's the dress. It's nice, it's elegant, it's classy, it's a midi. Beautiful. I have some thoughts. <laughs> I do think this is still like a keep. It depends on your body. I feel like my body is not cooperating. <laughs> cooperating with this dress. Now, I feel like it maybe I should have sized down into a four, but then I think it could have been kind of tighter in some parts because right now it's probably just right, right here for me, but it's very big here. And I think that's part of like the style of it. It's supposed to be a little bit more like larger and give you kind of like a faux curve look because my hips don't go that far out, but when I sit, they do. <laughs> so it gives you some sitting room. The, these little buggers keep poking me in the chest and this is not my bra. This is the dress. It looks like my bra. My bra is like right under it though. So essentially it's like your bra, but not your bra. So this part's pretty. That's kind of what sold me on getting this, but also the belt has no loop. So it just keeps loosening. So that is not okay. <laughs> Especially for ASOS Lux. Hello, give me some buttonholes and you know, something to stick in there. But yeah, so I'll give you a little look at the back. It is classy, it is elegant, but you know, I think we could be doing better ASOS Lux. I don't know. And then I'll give you more of a view of the back. Ah, uh, for having done this whole haul because I saw this dress and inspired this whole thing, I'm a bit disappointed. So I'm gonna say it is a leave, definitely not a keep. We have another really fun one. So this one is ASOS Design and it's $60 and it's a size six. And I love it already. It has a cowl neck sequin number with a cute belt that ties in, but gives you a little bit of a cinch. So that's kind of nice. And it is a mini dress. Um, Yes, so we do like this one. I'd say this one's an easy one. It's comfortable, it's not super fitted, and it's flattering because, you know, I mean, really, how can you not look cute in this number? It's so simple and elegant and cute. It can kind of go with anybody's style or taste. But let me give you more to go off of. There is no adjustable strap, so that's a problem. But I've been having problems so far, as you've seen, <laughs> with adjustable straps, and this seems fine. I think it's because of the cowl neck. It doesn't really need to be at a certain spot, but it hits perfectly. 
for me. And I do like, like the sequence doesn't hurt. It's not scratchy. It doesn't feel like I'm gonna be rubbing all night on it. So I just think the belt is such an elegant touch. It, it makes the whole dress because otherwise it'd be kind of baggy. Yeah, I mean, for the price point, you can't beat it. This is a for sure keep. Again, linked below. Here we go with a more cozy vibe. Now this is still ASOS, but it's a Miss Selfridge dress. This dress is $53 and I got it in a size four. Now I will say it is really comfortable. It has its sweater material and it's thin sweater material. So it's not gonna make you too hot. But if you are dancing, I warn you, you probably will get hot. And I'll give you a full look, but how cute is this little slit here? I love it. It does so much to this whole look. I'm not a fan though of these like really around your neck type of dresses, like turtleneck dresses. Ah, I can't, they drive me crazy. And I will say it does make me feel a bit choked. <laughs> so not a keep for me, but that's because it's just a preference of mine. I don't go for these types of dresses. Tried it on so that you could see it. But um, I'll show you the back. The back is gorgeous. So cute, so pretty. Easy, right? So if you're like wanting to dress up, but you're not going somewhere, we're gonna wear like a clubby dress like we tried on today. This is a nice alternative, don't you think? But yes, for me, it is a leave. All right, guys, final dress, and it's our most expensive. <laughs> so this is ASOS Design, and I have it in a size four, and it's $140. Now I'm gonna tell you, is it worth it? Let's go ahead and find out. So as you can tell, I'm already covering myself because my bra keeps making a uninvited um, appearance, but here we are. <laughs> so I will say it actually fits really comfortably. Like I feel secure in it. Obviously that's not the case, but it's actually really pretty. I'm not usually one who goes for a brown dress, but I might be turning the corner. So let's walk through it. So it's beautifully embellished. Don't mind my bra. I'm gonna try to hold this in place. But um, I love the cutouts. I thought this was gonna actually be a bit tricky on and it, and it is. So I don't know, you, I think it's just one of those that you just don't wear a bra and you hope for the best. But uh, you gotta fill it out, I think, or else you're gonna have to put tape on. I don't know. But um, I had to keep my bra on, but you could see a lot of straps going on. Can't really hide your bra. I don't know, it feels like it's a little more mature for my tastes. Not my favorite. Bit disappointed for the $140 price tag that I did pay full price for. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and say for me, it's it's a leave. But it, you might like it. I don't know, what do you guys think of this dress? Is this worth $140? Cause I don't think so. So, but I'll give you a last look and twirl. Whoa. So, um, yeah, sorry guys, this is a leave. Thank you guys for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. And please, please, please hit the subscribe button so I can monetize my channel and do better, more exciting content for you. And please let me know if you like this video, if you'd like to see more, or if you have any suggestions on things you'd like to see, I'm always listening. So thank you so much again and see you next time. Happy holidays. Ciao.